Hi everybody, it's Thelma. Today is almost the end of February already. It's hard to believe. This is an open collaboration that anybody can join in. Oh, I would love to see more people join in. And all you need is one stamp in order to do it. I don't care if you have what kind of stamps you use. Um, paper or anything else. There's uh, nothing I would like to see. Lots of tips and tricks that you have or that you know of and, and you've tried and how did they work for you. Any information about stamping is great. I just love stamps. So I started this open collaboration hoping that, I mean, I'm not the only one that likes stamps. So, anyway, uh, I thought I would show you. People have been asking and wanting see, to see how and what I did for last year and what I use for stamps, what I have. I have a lot. And, and then I've got wooden pieces. A lot of these do not have names because I took them out of the package. This is Happy Easter and it's got three chicks and it has eggshells and a tiny butterflies so what I and I think I probably got this from uh, scrapbook.com but I'm not sure I made um, this and you I, you seen it last week and I made two or three cards like that And I moved the eggshells around. There's my coloring. I use just uh, mostly Laurentian, which is probably a Canadian brand for pencil crayons. And I picked up another one, Crazy Z Art. And I think I got these from the Dollarama too. But I like color engine, the nice colors and easy to work with. And it just might be Canadian, I'm not sure because I don't live in the United States. So I got that stamp. And then what other one I have is this one I think I got from, um, it's so cute. I think I got that from uh, AliExpress. This one, it's called Hop To It by Becky Moore. It's a photo play and I probably got this one from um, scrapbook.com too. That's where I first got it until I got into Ellie. And I use the bunny mostly, so, and the uh, butterfly. And I have a die cut that says Happy Easter. And then I just put For You With Love. And that is on this one. This one does not have a name either. It's a hedgehog. It's a mouse. 
a bunny with another bunny and it looks uh, it's got a patch on it so it's probably like a stuffed animal they look like a stuffed animal with a stuffed bear and then this one is a, a bear with an umbrella so those were the three that i used mostly and then i used the happy easter die so, and i'll show you i used the bunny and then i colored it and i took three strips of paper and i just had three small ones put them vertical took a white one that had texture and put the bunny on and then for contrast more to, to make, get the bunny to, to um, stand out a little bit more I used pink paper because of the white it he didn't stand out his whiskers and stuff so much so that's what I did and then on the inside it just put happy Easter so there's the one with the um, butterfly. And then this one, I used the leftover pink paper. Like, I used the leftover for the pink. And this over here. And he's on pop dots. And so is the butterfly. And then Happy Easter. And then Happy Easter on the inside. So those were my coloring for those pictures. And then what I did this week, other than coloring those, I did two um, ATC cards. For St. Patrick's Day. So lucky. And then this one. And there's a little doily in the back. I did two colors of green. And I colored seeing a leprechaun. And then there's a cauldron. And he's sitting on the pot. So I got wishing you a pot of gold. I haven't finished the back yet, but, and then I used this stamp, and it says, Happy St. Patrick's Day, wishing you a pot of gold, and all the joy your heart can hold, hard to find and lucky to have, he, 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 you can't catch me, a good friend is like a four-leaf clover. And this, I think, I got from uh, AliExpress, too. Mm -hmm. So I did that. And then... Excuse me. Yeah, see, there's the other Easter card I colored. See how I moved the egg around? The big egg shells? So I did those for today. And I'm starting on um, another card. And then I'm starting on uh, ATC cards. So yeah. And it says, wishing you pot of gold. I do not have very much St. Patrick's Day, but I'll show you my stickers. This one is a lawn fawn. Oh, yes, I made an ATC card for Easter, too.
And this one I think I got from um, scrapbook.com. It says, Lucky, Happy St. Patrick's Day. I'm so lucky to know you. A good friend is like a four-leaf clover. Hard to find and something to have. Lucky to have. Your little let the shenanigans commence. <laughs> and then I have, yeah, this one. And it's from Gina K Designs. And it's called Luck, Love and Luck. You are my forever friend. So lucky to have a friend like you with all my love. A paper hug included. And then I have Best O Luck. And this one is from Studio G. And it's got the number and it says Katie and company. <laughs> so if you'd be interested in joining this collaboration, all you need to do is to um, subscribe to my channel and subscribe to Paula's um, Crafting by the Pond channel and uh, use the hashtag Stamping Sunday. Everybody have a great day and thank you very much for watching and subscribing to my channel and uh, liking the video. Bye now. Take care everyone.